Hey cellos, this is Mr. Barrett. This is the middle section of Ashokan Farewell on the cello. We're going to be going from 32, where we left off on the previous video, all the way to 52. Um, this part has the most moving notes. Um, there's a lot of measures in here that are kind of tricky to get under all of these slurs. So I would practice a lot of this, uh, just like one measure at a time, making sure you're getting all the notes correctly, then making sure you're getting the slurs correctly. Kind of like the process we did last video. Um, but even slower and even more, um, even smaller chunks, just single measures even. But we're going to start right at the second ending, right where we left off last time. Um, we're going to do four measures before 37. So this is second ending, and then the three measures after that, and then I'm going to stop when I get to 37. I'm going to do this all separate bows, and in that second measure there, you see B, A sharp, A natural. Uh, that I'm going to play by going from first position into half position, and I'm going to play B with my second finger, and A sharp with my low first finger, and then open A. So that's how I'm going to be playing that. You can also shift up into fourth position and do 3, 2, 1 if you would rather close off that A natural. But otherwise, half position, 2 and 1. You can watch me do it before you want to play along, but here is those four measures, second ending, those four measures with no slurs. I'm going to be going this fast. One and two and three and here we go. One and two and three. Uh, my tone is a little bit weird, but um, you can see the pitfalls right after you go in from half position. When you land on that G, a lot of the times you're going to end up flat because you're coming from half position, so make sure you get up high enough for that G. But let's try those four measures with a slur now. If you messed up, go back, try it again. One, and two, and three. So that's a bit tricky. Starts on up bow. If you started down bow, rewind, try it again. You do up, down, up, down. And this is the first time at this point in the music where the bows stop lasting for a whole measure. A lot of the stuff before this, it's a whole three beats of down, whole three beats of up. Now there's a lot of changes. So make sure you're really paying attention to the bowing that's written. Here's 37. Um, this is another spot where I would go measure by measure if you're having trouble. But before we do this little chunk, I want to skip ahead to 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, and 42. 41 and 42, you have this. Just listen once. That F sharp is tied across. So you have one and two and tie two, three. Listen to it one more time. One and two and three and one and two and three. It lasts for beat three and beat one, so don't let that throw you off. Here's 37 to 45. I'm going to go slowly. No slurs. I'm just reading the notes here. Follow along. And like I said, if you're having trouble, just do one measure at a time. Here's 37. One and two and three. One, two, that section with no slurs, just the notes. Again, if you're having trouble, can't emphasize this enough, just focus on one measure. That second to last measure there, measure 43, has this. That's a little bit tricky. It's like a finger tongue twister. It's like a finger twister. So make sure you've got that all down before you move on with me. Uh, here is now 37 to 45, that same tempo with slurs. These slurs are tricky. There's a lot of things that are written in that are changed from the printed music, so really make sure you're paying attention to the, the music on this PDF. Here we go. One and two and three. Two. And that 
takes us to 45. Now, notice a lot of these slurs end up making your down ending end up making a down bow land on the down beat. A lot of these bowings are designed that way. So if you're on an up bow and you're on the down beat of the measure, something might be a little bit off. Like you notice those last three measures are down, 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 up, up, down, 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 up, down, always landing on a down bow. But let's go ahead and move on. This is 45 to 52. This is the last little chunk here. Um, something I want to point out, we have another extension uh, in 45, 46, 47, 48, 49. You see a dotted quarter note and you see E, D, and C sharp in that measure. So C sharp, make sure you're doing extension four. That means that second finger in the next measure is used to play B. So you go three for F sharp, one for E, open for D, extension four for C sharp, second finger for B. So I'm gonna try that measure alone once if you wanna play with me. This is measure 49. Um, it's with the F sharp, the dotted note. Listen to it once, it goes like this. One and two. So, I was a little out of tune, I'll tell you that one more time. One and two. That's a little bit better. So you're going a dotted quarter, and you've got that C sharp, so don't let that throw you off. Here's 45 to 52. This is all notes, no slurs yet, no slurs. Here we go, 45, one and two and three. us to 53. Um, 52, that's a little different. They change the bowing there. They do two, uh, two notes under a down bow slur, two notes under an up bow, sl up bow slur, and then the last two eighth notes before 53 are separate. So if you want to watch and listen once, this is how 52 should look when we had our slurs. <laughs> down, up, down, up. Those last two notes are different. So here is now 45, we're gonna play through with the slurs. Again, I'll say it a thousand times. If you're having trouble with a measure, try just that measure alone, get the notes, then get the slurs, then play it with me. Here's 45, one and two and three. Two. measure really crescendo through there. All right, so here's the part where I'm gonna go back all the way to 32, that second ending. I'm gonna play from there all the way through down to 52. So once you've got all of these measures under control, you know what you're doing, come here in the video and play it with me. Here we go. Measure 32, one and two and three. takes us to 53. A quick disclaimer, I did, I missed one note in that first measure, I played a G instead of an A, and I messed my bowing up in the tie at 42. So if you're watching back in the video, there were two little errors there. But uh, follow your music, uh, let me know if you have any questions. There's a lot going on in this middle part, there's a lot of moving notes. So like I said a thousand times in this video, uh, if you're having trouble with a measure, like if I'm having trouble with measure 44, I'm gonna get just the notes. Make sure I get the 
notes in the rhythm, then I'm gonna add the slur in. Cool, and then I'm gonna add the other measures around it in. And I'm like, oh, okay, got it, cool. So, always go slowly, do small chunks, make sure you're successful. It's a, it's a terrible way to practice if you're just, oh crap, oh man. And you're just making the same mistake over and over, that's not helping anybody. Go slow, take out the slurs, get the notes really well, and then add the slurs back in, and then add the measures around it back in. And uh, you'll, you'll find success, I promise. Just, just put a little work in. I know this middle part's kind of tough. It's got those extensions, but you can do it. So I will see you again in the last video where we'll go through the ending, but until then, happy practicing.